What's up, y'all? What's up? What's up? Flanagan, how you doing, man? I am, uh, man, I've just been grinding, y'all. Just grinding. I got all kinds of legendary schematics. I got some pets dialed in. Um, I've fixed the base a little bit. It's still not perfect, but a few observations on the pathing. Let's, uh, let's jump in here. I'm about due for a raid. But I think I'm in pretty good shape. So here's my here's my path. To, oh. Homie came out of his Nope. We need you to get back in there and get to breeding more. They come out of the Yeah, see we're we're bugged. They come out of the uh breeding periodically i found the easiest thing to do is to just take them out and put them back in so i'm doing a little cross breeding here for a kingpin and i'm about to give up on it to be honest um for now i mean i'll come back to it no all right let's uh try this again so if we pull you out and we pull you out, and we'll put you back in first. These uh, jet ragons are a pain in the ass to catch, man, when they're running around. Mm -hmm. Luckily, they were glitching into a wall there. I absolutely hate this mount. No, it's all uh, there. It's target farmed. Um, did he go in? It did not go in. Yep. Hmm. Very strange. Very, very strange. Let me try putting the other one in first. Pull you back out for now. We'll put you back in. Hmm. Might need to put them back in the box and reload the game. Yeah. Looking like, uh, looking like that's probably the case. Alright. Let's do that. It doesn't happen. They'll go on a stretch. They'll do really, really good for a while. That is the Jet Ragon jet dragon jet and dragon combined it looks terrible it looks like a fucking balloon pardon my language it looks like a balloon uh how you doing nico you actually get polymer from it when you kill it i mean it is a balloon right all right let's try this again And don't run off too far, please. Yep. Ooh, got him. Yeah, anyway, I don't have... There we go. I don't have the right bases. I don't have two good bases, so I'm really relying on RNG quite a bit. And when you're relying on RNG 100%, it's... You're just going to make a million um, pals before you get it, you know? All right, so they getting it again. We've probably got some eggs to hatch. I'm going to, anyway, this is the last round brewing on these. And the reason being is I got two really good Frost Allions to, um, to breed. I got, like, some god-tier shit. I got real lucky. I don't have very many kills in either. I probably got maybe 10 or 15 kills. Ferocious, serious, and muscle head. What I'm looking for here is legend 
ferocious, like muscle head, and then something else. But the reason I'm giving up on this, yeah, we're just not gonna get it. The reason I'm giving up on this guy is I, I'm gonna want to revisit it later, because uh, I'm gonna want to get that ice, or, or I'm gonna want to get water, the water damage on him. Yeah, we got all trash. Um, that's unfortunate. Let's get these brewing. I still got a bunch of uh, Jet Ragon eggs here. Um, additionally, I've been getting... Oh, the schematics, the schematics. I've been having incredible luck with them. Um, now, it is RNG. It's a drop, right? So, you get the legendary crossbow drops from Bushy. Uh, so, you can get that at level 23. Now, obviously, you're not going to have the materials at level 23 to craft it, but... Theoretically, you could get it at level 23. Um, the assault rifle drops from Blazamut. The shotgun drops from Suzaku. I actually left a marker there <laughs> because I'm always having trouble finding him. Um, the handgun drops from Beacon. Uh, Beacon? Uh, the rocket launcher drops from Jet Ragon. And then, like, there's a bow that drops from somebody else. I wish there's no, um... Speaking of, I want to get, uh... I want to get my... Wrong bench. I want to get the assault rifle craft, and they take forever to craft, and the materials are crazy. Now, here's the deal. You see a lot of people complaining about the, um... Okay, so I need, what, 100 and some carbon fiber and a bunch of refined ignorance. The carbon fiber. Um, yeah, we got a bazillion coal from the... Let's just make 200. You should pump those out pretty quick. And then... What else was it? The refined ingots, or...? Yeah, refined ingots need a shitload of them. We got some... That's pal metal. Oh, I got 150 here. Let's take, the, you know, I need to, uh, I'm just going to put the handgun up, I think. Um, I'll keep the crossbow for, for situations where I don't want to do as much damage. Oh, I can still walk, just barely, but. Alright, so we need more refined ingots. Just get them pumping everywhere. Oh, anyway, you hear people complaining about the bones. The bones are easy, y'all. You're gonna have so much cash to spend. Oh, I don't have... My base is not fine-tuned. I mean, there's only one level 4 worker. That's uh, a newbie in the entire game. As far as I'm aware. Um, I do have uh, Anubis running around. Or you mean on the fire? I'm using level 3s on the fire. In fact, we can uh, drop him here to help out for a moment. Yeah. All right. I mean, I still got a lot to do. You know, I am far from over. Like, I've been grinding specifically movement and weapons and power. I, I, I haven't done any optimization on the base at all. Okay, we only need 20 more refined ingots and then that carbon fiber. 
So yeah, I got a long, long time to go. There, there are a couple of, as far as general workers, no, there's only one for uh, Anubis is it. Um, but as far as, um, you know, another thing too that I neglected, sorry, I'm getting sidetracked here. Another thing that I got that I seriously neglected was, um, the f skill trees, the fruit, and those are so important. I mean, even if you have your pals dialed in, if you don't have the the skills, you know, it don't matter. Right. Here, let's fix this. Oh, you know what else I need to do? I'm going to take these baked berries over to the mines real quick because they're getting low on food. Uh, that and the baked berries are not being used now. I'm not using them at all. all right, so I'm not going to bother falling all this stuff over right now, but we will throw these in here. Actually, I guess they're not... All right, dumped bread in there already. It's all right. We got a shitload of food now. Oops. Getting all pokey smart. Not really. Uh, I'm still learning quite a bit. Uh, our... Do I think it will change the game industry? I don't think it will change the game industry at all. They're not doing anything new. They're just doing something that hasn't... That there's a current need for. I mean, there's a bazillion survival games, and there's a bazillion Pokemon ripoffs, you know? It's just, there's no good combinations of the two. All right, now here's the Frostaliads I was talking about I'm going to breed. I'm going to breed this one, Legend, Ice Emperor, and Burly Body. And I want to get that with... Yeah, the Pen Kings are over the top. I'm going to combine some. I'm going to mix that with this one. Legend, Emperor, and Ferocious. So we got a female there and we got a male there. And if I can get Legend, Ice Emperor, Burly Body, and Ferocious, I'm going to have one mean, mean, mean ice attack. That may have been their fix to him getting stuck, Aramir. He was getting stuck every year. It was the... It's the biggest, the clown ship is the biggest, like, quality of life with the movement speed in the game. And it was the easiest of the 50s to catch because it literally would get stuck on everything. Uh, it's not the first game to pop off. So, no, I mean, the things they did didn't change anything in the industry. I mean, the, the, the pokey stands that hate the game and want it canceled. I mean, they're right and they're wrong. You, you know, is it a Pokemon ripoff? Of course it's a Pokemon ripoff. We all know that. But it's also a survival open world game where you can play with 32 people online. Why hasn't Nintendo done that? Yeah, I mean, Pokemon is just who... Pokemon's what took off. Pokemon stole it too. You know, but... It's not, nothing at all in this game or how they released the game. Oh, I got lucky, man. I went over, I went, well, I mean, I was farming the shit out of the sanctuary. But, um, I got two of them in one pass. But yeah, anyway, what they did, nothing at all is new. How they handled their business model, the game itself, this is all stuff that's been done before. The difference is, is they filled a massive, massive gap. And that's where the success came from. All right, what the hell was I doing? Uh, ingots. All right, Nico. Wow. 
They cooked him up. All right, we got the Ingus. This is going to take seven days. If they add zombies, it's the perfect game. <laughs> Pretty much, right? Or, they I mean, just their base attacks. Like, a lot of people are turning them off in endgame because it becomes more irritating than anything else. Boom. I got mixed emotions on using the assault rifle at all, to be honest, because it's so much ammo, you know? The problem I have right now is ammo. So, like, I'm using the shotgun for everything because it's the least amount of ammo consumed. I didn't know. I screwed up, too, when I built this place. I didn't know that there was metal. I didn't see it. I'd skipped it in the tree, and I never saw it. So I built all this out of stone. I just started replacing things with metal. Now, as far as the movement in the... Um, pal pathing. I told you guys I had some issues there. Well, first off, to get the beds dialed in, I had to take every pal out of the base and then assign, reassign the pals to the base based off of what bed size they use. That way, like, a little guy wasn't coming and taking the big bed and sleeping one of the big, or forcing one of the big guy, guys to sleep on the floor, you know? So I did that, but one with the farming, they have no problem coming up here gathering, um, planting, watering, but of course they wouldn't go all the way up top. However, they will come up here and help craft, but they won't come up here to loot something. Like, so if you've got something being made where it's dropping stuff on the ground, like uh, the berries here, they won't come up and get the berries, but they will come up to do work. Uh, everybody's busy right now or stuck. Um, or they'd be up there. Um, so learning that was quite helpful. And then... Like, these things, I don't like where they're at, and they're out a little bit, but the answer is I've got to destroy all that stuff and raise it up. Because if I put these back in here, then the pals... The pals like to go behind it, for some reason. And I tried switching it around, too. And they still went behind it. <laughs> so you have to give them room to do their business, you know? And th those furnaces I actually had up here. And nothing was coming up. It, like 50% of the time, the pals would get stuck and wouldn't be able to make it to it to uh, help out. So I moved those over here. Um, when everything's cooking, I run out of power, so I threw in a second, uh, a second bit of power, which is probably, uh, a red little redundant. Um, this jam-filled bun is, like, the easiest upgrade. Like, I was making these baked berries. The baked berries are trash compared to the jam-filled bun. And the only difference is, I mean, you got a mad, 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 mad amount of berries. Oh, absolutely, Jeffrey. There's no way. Um, so the jam-filled buns are the shit. Keep those. I, I've been keeping those crafting at all times. And I've also noticed that the sanity stays up. Like before, I was having a little sanity creep. Uh, if you look around now, 99, 100. I mean, every, they got good places to sleep. They got their little hot tub. And they've got decent food. And then, of course, this is all... All the cakeness. Got to have the cakeness. What we got there? Carbonara. I mean, with the amount of eggs we're getting, it's. I wonder if there's something out of out of honey. Because we're getting an overwhelming amount of honey. In fact, I better go over there and pick up because there's going to be a million things on the ground. But anyway, the things that the things that a lot of people are complaining about are actually really easy to overcome. As far as getting the different materials. Like the bones is a no-brainer. You just go buy them. You know? Yeah, see I had stuff despawn over here. Um, I'm pretty sure. There should be a lot more on the ground than this. Unless they're actually keeping up and picking up. Which I mean we'll check the box here in a moment. But yeah, it's pretty easy to get them going. Since we're never over here. 
This place never gets raided. Famous last words, raid incoming. <laughs> and of course, they're dumping everything in here. Um, I had that massive amount of tomatoes. I just am feeding them the tomatoes. So, yeah, man, the honey seriously stacks up. So eventually I'll probably take honey out of here and go more eggs or whatever. And then that's the thing with the eggs. Like, what food do you make? Because, I mean, there's a few standout foods. There's definitely a few standout foods. Um, we'll take a look at them here. Well, actually, I got everything cooking right now. But, but yeah, you see the amount of milk, eggs, honey, and everything. It's just getting enormous. A lot of people are turning raids off, Froggy. I haven't turned them off yet. Um, but they're, they're more of an irritant than anything. They don't like, you know, like a couple things might get destroyed. None of it's ever the end of the world. It's more just like, it's an irritating factor more than anything. And I need to make some more, I want to kill, uh, or I want to make an, my first attempt here on stream today on, uh, Palladius, but I'm scared. <laughs> I'm scared. Yeah. These uh, legendary weapons take a long, long, long time. Your rage just stopped. It's supposed to be every three days, I thought. Um, but it seems like it's pretty intermittent. Um, I need gunpowder, and this is the grind right here, the gunpowder, and it's because I don't have sulfur automated anywhere. So, like, to get sulfur, I gotta check my inventory, try to get it as low as possible. Now let's get these eggs out of the inventory. Just every little thing. And it's the, you barely get any sulfur. It fills up your weight, you know? But let's go get some. Oh, wow. You haven't had one for full, three full real days. <laughs> Where do I want to go? We want to go up, up and in. No? Eh, there's a little, little tickle. I want to get one of them spinny turtles dialed in because those things are just cool as hell. I mean, I know Anubis does great with the mining. I mean, obviously it's slow compared to me bringing a pickaxe, but I just got rid of my pickaxe and axe altogether. I need to get an Anubis dialed in. Like, I really, really do. The problem is, is I got so hard stuck on combat, I didn't do any... I haven't dialed anyone in for efficiency at all. And it's because I wanted all the combat, you know? Oh, I have killed Anubis 70 times at least. <laughs> That's an exaggeration. Let's see. I wish it was all alphabetical. Yeah, I can shoot the rocks. I'm just, it, you know, I'm in that. I mean, I'm here because I'm running out of ammo, you know? So I'm trying not to waste any. And I don't have a melee weapon on me. Where the hell are you at? There it is. 50, I've killed, I've done 56 Anubis hatches or kills. 
I mean, I guess I can shoot it with the crossbow. I mean, there's already more than my fill on the ground right there. I'm sure, right? No, not yet. Oh, shit, that was actually nothing. I was only 36. Oh, my God. Yeah, this takes way too long. I'm going to have to shoot it. Got that one out. That dig toys. That thing is so goddamn cool, man. I know it's not the best one to use, but it is crazy cool. Yeah, it's way quicker to just shoot it. You're right. This is my first outing without the pickaxe at all. I wanted to equip more weapons, you know? Don't get uppity, Van Worm. Why you gotta be that way? I was just chilling here. I was just chilling. Stupid Van Worm. Anything else handy? There's something. There's two right next to each other. Perfect. This was, if there was a spot with sulfur ore and coal, that would be the shit. You know? There, yeah, everybody knows about the Iron Coal place, I think. It's all over the internet now. I mean, that's a hot spot, right? Why are all you damn birds getting uppity with me? There's way better sulfur spots in the desert, I feel like. Everything's so spread out over here. Good spot at the tower. I don't know. I just know there's some really, really good spots over at the desert. Um, I don't have a mark, though. That's another thing, too. Uh, using the map tools. Mark shit on the map, y'all. Anyone that's just starting playing, you're going to be so grateful you did. Like, pick an icon for black market vendors and use that on everyone you come to. You know, pick an icon for, um, 
like the fruit trees, you know? And then when you get close to it, when you get close to those items, they're going to light up and it's going to make them way, way easier for you to spot. Oh, please don't run out of juice. Oh, yeah. None of them are big nodes, but this definitely fill me up. This is the spot then, right? If you're just going to come for a quick fill up. But that's the challenge is this is the one thing that's not automated and it's required to make ammo. <laughs> so that's the challenge, you know. I think Microsoft is going to get the game shut down. There's zero chance. All right, I'm slightly over full. Don't want to try to make it over there. I mean, if I'm going to do that, I might as well get it all, right? It's going to take forever. <laughs> the, well, the struggle you get is the cake, you know, like breeding. What's up, Tester? Breeding is such a strong, strong portion of the game. Like, you really want, um... Oh, no. God, I hate it when it does that. Oh, it unset. Unfixed. Um, anyway. The cake is such a big portion of the game that you almost have to dedicate something to cake. And then you got that one spot. What the hell? It's not letting me go at all now? Let me try to go up. Hmm. Well, God damn it. That's not a bummer. Well, rather than sit here and mess with this, I'm just gonna do this. And then I'll come back and get the other half. Uh, if it's still here. I need to put more work into my base. Oh, you've been doing everything all one base? Yeah, there's just not enough room, you know? All right, is it still going to be there? Nope. It's gone. That's all right. Lesson learned. Go ahead and just get back and get that craft. And that was a pretty good haul right there. Like, I mean, you could go really, really hard on, um,. You could go really, really hard on the food and get, like, thousands and thousands saved up. That way you don't have to worry about the cake-making supplies. And then switch something over to a sulfur, I think, would probably be the way to do it. Looks like my eggs are ready again. Assault rifle acquired. All right, let's get some more rockets. I got 83, but... Actually, I need uh, more gunpowder first. Shit, I gotta make more charcoal. God dang it. Yeah, but anyway, a lot of people are talking online about the cement. You see, I got 530 bones. The pal fluids are harder to come by than the, the bones are. And everybody's complaining about the bones. All right, well, I mean, I gotta make it. I can't not do it. That will be super quick to make a bazillion of them, though. 
Well, I mean, a legendary crossbow is awesome, but how far is that going to get you versus the the end game guys? You know. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm saying. You just buy the bones. Like I bought a thousand of them at once, and they weren't that expensive. You know, I. That's why I don't know. Maybe that was old info. That could have been old info. Yeah, can't buy the pal fluids. You got to just go get them. It's a little easier if the pal fluids are dropping from a boss that you're farming. You end up loading up a lot of them, or a particular mob that you're farming. But they also, it also goes crazy quick, you know? The hardest thing for me has definitely been ammo. Well, money, earning money is a convenience, you know? You, you end up, you gotta, you gotta free up spots, so you just go sell it all and you make a bazillion, a bazillion, uh, bits of, uh, what is it, gold or whatever the currency is. All right. Just snooze it out here and get a fresh day going. There's a vendor? That sells pal fluid? I mean, that would be huge. That would make me start slinging rounds with that assault rifle. That's my hesitation right now to use it, though. Yeah. Well, there's level 50 alpha bosses. I don't think that there's a level 50 area yet where everything is level 50. And that's where a dungeon, a level 50 dungeon would be. But it's also, it's not... I mean, obviously the level plays a big factor in it, but it's not as much about the level. I mean, there's reason when you're level 50 to go farm a level 20 mob, you know? The first animal you saw was a lucky sheep. <laughs> I guess I could be a champ and help out, but... I just don't add very much. I think I still got a million shotgun shells, too. So we should be good on that. We want to make some rockets. It's 40 rockets. I mean, if I can't kill it in 40 rockets, it ain't dying. <laughs> Alright, let's yoink these eggs. I want to pull these guys out and get those two uh, frosties in here. Like I said, I'm giving up on... Um, I, I, I'm not using the correct bases to get... Uh, I was all excited when I saw you could put legend on anything, you know? So I wanted to start throwing legend on stuff, and I didn't have... I don't have the correct bases for everything. Ferocious Workaholic Vanguard. I mean, that Ferocious Workaholic are both not bad bases for the for the base, you know? Ferocious Runner Legend Divine Dragon. Well, Divine Dragon I don't want. Runner I don't want. That one's just straight trash.
That one's straight trash. One more egg. And that one's straight trash. So what I'm going to do for now for a combat pet, uh, for water anyway, I still got to get the proper skills on him, but I'm going to go, I'm just going to work on this guy, Legend Ferocious. Obviously it's incomplete, but for now, that's going to be my water guy. Um, so I'm going to let those cook. Let's grab these guys and yoink them. And let's go with this one. This Frostalion. Yep. So that was what? That's a male. And we'll mix that. With this. Legend Ice Emperor Ferocious. Man, if I could get all those, I am going to be so stoked. I mean, I'm sure I will. It's just a matter of time. All right. Get to breeding. Now, how this the skill fruit trees, how often do those reset? Like, how often can you go back to them? Is it every three days? Cheaper saying. <laughs> yeah, I don't think I'm going to do anything with this assault rifle right at the moment. Sea Breeze, uh, Castaway Beach has two merchants. Follow the beach northeast to find them from Broncherry. Hmm. Do you know the coordinates? I don't know where that is. I mean, would it be up in here? Or is it that guy? That guy's a black market trader. I don't know. Let's just go look. I don't know where it is. 184, 617. Negative 617. Well, I mean, that's nowhere near the Ron Cherry boss. Oh, negative 184. I was thinking, huh? <laughs> Oh, that Broncherry. I see what you're saying. Not the Broncherry Aqua, the the regular Broncherry. And where was it? Minus 184, 617. Gotta be right around this one. All right, it should be just down the beach here, right? 
Oh, right there in that gray area that I or that uh, fog of war area that I haven't uncovered yet. Great, the tiniest little spot. Other merchants are not here. Or is he hiding somewhere? Oh, right across the water. Hmm, I don't see him. Oh, there he is. See who he's got. Well, I mean, this doesn't do anything for me, though, at the moment. Well, I mean, he didn't have any good pals uh, that I wanted, but. Is there a way to be up to or a place to buy pal fluid? Do you guys know? Oh, you were talking about bones. Bones you can just buy from this camp. The guy's always there. You don't have to look for him. Oops. You have to farm uh, pal fluid. Skill fruit tree on the hill here. Let's see. I got a map. A skill. I got the skill uh, fruit stuff all marked on a map. Oh, I've already got that one marked. It's right there. Appreciate it. it. Says it can be bought. Well, I can tell you if you ever see it, buy it like your entire uh income's worth any money you have <laughs> the bones you can just go to um to the small settlement right here and homie sells bones and he's always here 24 7. Yeah, man, if I ever see Pal Fluid, I'm buying that shit out. But yeah, he's got an unlimited supply of bones. They're only 100 each. So, I mean, like right now, I got 670,000 gold. I could buy a whole lot of bones, you know. But, new Pal Fluid. I'm sure there's probably an effective farm or whatever for it. I just don't know what that is. I didn't see if anybody mentioned it though. Does anybody know how often the skill, uh, the fruit trees reset? Well, the problem going with the easy kills is they don't drop very many. Where when you go with the bigger kills, they drop a lot. Like we got guys going hungry. And it's because the doors are janky. Go eat, y'all. Go eat. That open door needed to be closed and opened. Oh, shit. They running around? No, they're still in there. They just getting feisty. Dim folks getting feisty in there. All right, still got 10 minutes on that stuff. Rockets complete. Um, for anything else, I just want to get going. Some more circuit boards, maybe. Yeah, that's true. That's true. 
Um, alright, so what are we gonna do? What time is it? It is... It's only about halfway through the day. I don't... I, I, I'm... I'm not ready to put my big boy pants on and go up here after Palladius yet, y'all. I want to do it today, but I'm scared. I mean, I guess what's the worst thing that can happen? I gotta run back and... I gotta, I gotta run back to my body and pick all my shit up. Uh, I gotta at least wait for a full day. That way I got plenty of time. I don't wanna be, it be getting dark on me. Let me just go, um... Let me see, is there an, an area? There's 18 of the skill fruit trees. I marked them with this icon. How many do I have marked? One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Uh, Eleven, twelve, thirteen. It looks like I got not all of them, but a bunch of them marked. Let's just run out and check the, uh... Go check the... Oh, I wanted to uh, clear some space. That's right. Yep. So, even though this guy is not good, or not fine-tuned, I'm going to clear some space and dump uh, trash tier guys into it just to get him out of here. Like Divine Dragon. Really? If had Diet Lover by itself, I'd probably save it. So I want to say, I like saving a blank one too. That one right there is a g great Pen King base uh, for, for mating, but I don't have the right uh, counterpart for it right at the moment. So many pen kings. I've got a bunch of those, I think. Cold blooded, of course, is trashed here, but it's still a damage bonus if I set him up as ice. I'll just save that one for now. I don't have enough to go up again, right? Yeah. But that freed up a bunch of space, so I'm happy with that. See, it, t it takes more than a game day, though, I swear. Um, I mean, I've gone and checked them. There's a couple close by, right? There's one uh, right there. That I just looted not too long ago. Let me check it. How's it at? Probably up top here. Yeah. Yeah, I see nothing on it. So it's definitely not one game day. I mean, if it was one game day, it would make it way, way easier. <laughs> you know, to get the skills. Let's go. I haven't looked at these in a long time way up here. I can go look at Palladius and get scared. Oh yeah, I've been breeding like crazy, Rickus. What? 
These, I know it's been a several game days. Um, I don't know exactly how many, but it has been a bunch. Should be right up top there, huh? Oh, there it is. Oh, hiding. Okay, yeah, this one, this one, I don't know how long, because it's been a long time. Uh, the mini bosses, the alpha bosses are every three days. I know that, um, as I've been, you know, there's all those legendary weapons did not come, uh, come easy. That was a whole lot of farming. I um I actually uh went into the server settings and shortened the days uh just because it was taking too long for the days to go by you know You're going to make the gap. Come on, you could do it. Ooh, he's not going to make it. And you get bugged in that um You get bugged in the, uh, in the aim down sights mode. Is there a trait that lowers stamina usage? What was that? Bubble. Ignis Breath. Dark Laser. Dark Laser is a good one, but I got a bunch of them. All right. Go over to that one. I think we can make this one. Maybe. Yeah, piece of cake. That's another hard lesson uh, I learned is I didn't farm these as I was playing. Like, I mean, if I ran into one, I would collect it. But... Now I've got uh, these guys that have decent abilities or, or decent passives, but their abilities are trash, you know? That guy is so cool looking, that Syndicate Crusher. I mean, if you could capture them and keep them, I would so get that guy and level them up. That is just the coolest thing ever. Yeah, I'm trying to play the intended experience, though. I haven't messed around with that stuff. I know that there's... Uh, I need some more Dig Toys bases. Going on, Mirage. Um, annoyed. I saw you asked about Pal Essence. Yeah, it's definitely worth it, but don't. I would say don't blow everything into one right away. Wait until you get one fine tuned, because like I went real hard on that Ragnarok at the beginning, and now wishing I wouldn't have. Good lord, man. Let's 
guy does not want to get in the box. There's jam sandwiches in there, dude. Don't run off. Yeah. We got jam sandwiches. <laughs> Good lord. This guy does not want to get in the box. Finally. Wow. First, we got a junker. Uh, they weren't wasted. I, I need some bases of that pet. I don't want to just breed for bases, you know? I don't feel like that's at all wasted. Especially when all that stuff, the balls, it's just a time grind. Ooh, 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 forgot to take away the pet. Oh, yeah, he dead. The balls are just a time grind. You know, it's super easy to come by. Um, I need better cold armor. What, what boss drops the legendary cold schematic? Like, the good one I know drops from those guys. They're not here now because it's dark, huh? The end game one, end game one drops from those guys. Get the hell out of here. Is that the closest? Yeah. Yeah, I feel so bad equipping the cold armor I have now. I mean, obviously, right now, I, anything would help when I'm not in combat, but... Um, the quality difference is so enormous, you know? What the hell, man? Oh, you got a plus two uh, shirt? I think I only got a plus one shirt. Let me see. Yeah, my both my hot and cold shirt are only plus one. My problem is I got this. <laughs> Heat resistant refined metal armor. 288 defense, 800 health. And then when I go somewhere cold, I've got this. 147 defense and 350 health. It feels like such an enormous downgrade, you know? Oh, I'm... I, I, I'm aware, I'm aware. I mean, I'm still learning things, but I didn't start yesterday, David. <laughs> you need some quality cloth. But of course I do. Oh, the shirts stack? Now, is there... I don't think there is yet, because I... You don't see any information about it, but is there any legendary accessories? All right, what did I need? God damn it, I can't remember what I need. Did I need high quality or regular? I'm going to assume I need needed high quality. Get to it, homie. Well, yeah, the... That's all that drops in dungeons. Um, you don't get, uh, legendary accessories from dungeons. Or legendary, uh... Or you found blue accessories. I see. I thought you were talking about the regular weapons and armor. But dungeons are not the place, uh, to farm... I mean, blue accessories, of course, are way better than what I'm using. I'm going to have to throw uh, some different pets in on the farm here soon to start collecting up some wool and stuff. All right, now, what was I trying to make? <laughs> Completely forgot what I was making. 
Well, goddamn. The legendary weapon schematics all come from alpha bosses. Um, you got... The crossbow comes from Bushy. The uh, handgun comes from Beacon. The shoddy comes from um, from Suzaku. The uh, assault rifle comes from Blazamut. And they're rare. You're going to have to kill them a bunch. I mean, I went two days. Two real life days. This granted, this is not in game days. I went two real life days, which was an enormous amount of kills, and never got the shotgun and handgun. And I got them back to back last night. I went up here and killed Suz uh, Suzaku and got the shotgun, flew right down to kill uh, Beacon, and got the handgun back to back after two days of grinding them. Yeah, that's the good stuff drops from the good, you know, from those guys. I know that drops there, but I'm looking for the refined metal. Um, not the pal one. I, I haven't killed those guys yet. I mean, I need to do it, right? I need to quit being a little chump and go do it. Shit, I can't remember what the hell I was crafting. Uh, I want to make some food, too. So I need to find, I think I need to go kill cows. Uh, before I get over. What was that one? Solar Blast. Oh, I wanted to repair something. That was right. Good catch, good catch. That would have sucked getting out there and uh, not being able to repair. My armor is screwed, or about to be. Alright, so it's good. Now, the food you want before you tackle any major fights... Is the burger there the cheeseburger? Mozarina cheeseburger. So you need to get some cows. It sucks too. I had a bunch of meat and it went bad. Where's the closest place to get cows? Well, let's look at the old pal deck. It looks like a cow. Looks like... Over yonder. North of Bushy. Yeah, I think that's the spot. Oh, is Bushy? Oh, wait a minute. Bushy, Bushy, where are you? I lost Bushy. I wish the check marks weren't there. There we go. I mean, I only need one. Well, I mean, obviously, I'm not going to just get one while I'm here, but... It's not like I need to farm 17 million uh, meats. Moo! Alpha Lilene knocked. Hmm. I don't think I've, I may not have killed that one yet. That's gotta, that's gotta be the one. Yeah. Cold resistant refined. That's the step, uh, the step up, uh, over what I've got. Oh, I've been playing the game nonstop. Why do I know? Oh shit, that was the carcass of the last one. Moo, where are all the cows? 
Cotton candy off those, really? Ain't want no cotton candy. And I ain't seeing no cows. I need to get some good dire how bases too. They crossbreed with a lot of things. What in the hell, man? God damn it, it did it again. Um, I'll have to look around on the map. I mean, she's an alpha. She thinks she'd be... You think she'd be marked on the map? Maybe I just haven't seen her yet. I mean, that's not a whole lot of beef, right? <laughs> but... It's not exactly a whole lot of pokey beef. Let's see. Aerial missile. Go. <laughs> uh, if it only didn't bug you in the animation. Oh, you don't even want to get uppity, do you? Oop. There we go. Yeah, I saw that. Uh, I got I got the notifications on for that stuff. It sucks that you got to go to wave 17 to get all the rewards, depending on how much that's going to take. Minus 160, 343. here somewhere once again in an area that I haven't uh, explored get over there in a sec let me get one more uh, get one more cheeseburger here cheeseburger cheeseburger not very dense we need cow. I wonder where the cow density is. All right, Mirage. Yeah, man. Get you some rest. Got to sleep, right? Where you at, you little grazers? All right, screw it. That's good enough. I guess I could check the black market merchant while I'm here. What you got, homie? That's one I haven't seen before. Trashy rolls on it. I mean, why not? Yep, new pal. One I have yet to yet to get. Um, 
you're dropping 38s at level 50 with your sheep? I would say you've got some kind of custom settings going on there, Godzilla. I don't, I don't think anyone else is having that sort of experience. <laughs> Not that I've seen anyway. It's getting late, huh? Yeah, it's only halfway through the day. What is that Lilene knocked? What is the element on that one? I don't think it matters, does it, does it? Where was it again? It was in here? The ice area. Oh, it's in this mess i'm sure i'll see it Let's see i've got that maxed already but you know at some point they're going to add something in for collecting them all. Well, there she is in a cave. Assuming, well, it's either got to be at the up up at the top or in a cave. Up at the top is the tower, though, so I can't imagine an alpha being right there. I got a marker, a map marker for that too. <laughs> it's a clown bus, Nico. It's a clown bus. worst looking thing in the game that happens to be twice as fast as anything else it's the developer's way of saying screw you guys we're gonna make this look like the worst of our pokemon copies and then we're gonna make it the fastest possible thing in the goddamn game Not seen a mining kit. I thought I saw one for a minute. With a dumb name like Jet 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 Ragon, Jet Ragon. All right, where the hell is this goddamn cave at? It could be anywhere. The cave coordinates are 163, 339. That's right by it. That's the coordinates of the boss. That's not the coordinates of the cave. A lot of the bosses are not where they're shown on the map because they're inside of a rock, you know, or they're inside of a mountain. So you got to find the cave to go into them. And I have no idea where the cave entrance is. It's all right. We'll find it. I use the boss face marker for the black uh, market dealer. I use the star for cave entrances. <laughs> But using anything is the right thing, you know? Not going to be over here.
yeah, you just gotta just gotta be consistent. Absolutely. You usually it usually pops up that there's a mine. One forty two three twenty. Oh wow, it's way down there. Holy shit. Is it really down there that far? I guess it's right under I'll just put that there for now. The gym boss. I don't know which one that is. really close to the fast travel that'll be good because you know it's not going to drop this time <laughs> rng don't love me that much there it'd be yeah anyway there's always a pop-up when you get close to it but you got to get really close to it you know all right, so let's get rid of... We'll just make that the star instead, so that I know that's the cave entrance. Talking about the bug. The bug with, um, with the clown ship? I mean, it's hard to get that fight done and not bug it, to be honest. Or you mean the bug with catching the tower bosses? I didn't do it. We are here. Lilene knocked. What up, girl? Let's, uh, let's give you the old rocket launcher opener here. And we'll make it fire damage, too. Just because, why not? <laughs> God, I love that shit. freeze move oh god damn it well i mean she still drops the schematic bird said no you dying mm. trashy trashy pal helm Well, I mean, you don't have to have the staff from uh, Ark to to have uh, an Ark sort of feeling, you know? He, you know the Ark guy is the ex-Dungeon Defenders guy. He was one of the... One of the um, original developers on DD1. He's the studio from hell guy. <laughs> well, 
Well, it's good to know. She'll be back in three days, can kill her again, uh, and actually get a capture in. But that, if I get that armor schematic, I'll feel pretty good about the cold area. And I don't need the cold armor for Palladius. I'm just being a wimp now. Good lord, why don't I go over there and fight that guy? Because I'm scared, y'all. I'm scared. He gonna kill me. Somebody's starving. I'm assuming they're glitched outside. Let's see. Go eat you something, homie. God, he's going right to work. He's starving. Or no, that's not the same. That's not the right one. I thought I saw Sanity Zero. Huh. I guess it was the right one. He ate something on the road. All right, so I need to go get my tomatoes. In fact, I'm going to cut those guys off from the tomatoes. Where did I have the tomatoes? Was that the, the mining base or was it at the other one? I think it's at the mining base. Nope. That's the other one. Yeah, he caused a lot of issues prior to that, though, uh, Nick. He didn't throw them into anything. They pursued it, and they got paid. Uh, those guys paid Trendy like $40 million. So they got theirs. That didn't hold them up at all. That was a personal fight between real-life friends that went sour with each other is what that was. All those guys knew each other from school. Oh, he threw wildcard into a problem. Yeah, I definitely threw wildcard into a problem. Let's take that stuff for now. Oh, I wanted the tomatoes. Uh, sorry, y'all. You losing. Oop, wrong way. What do we want to give him? We'll give him some JM Sammies. And we will... Get back to base the good old fashioned way. I did the 10 of everything that I could find, and then I farmed a shitload of bosses. Getting the legendary weapons basically leveled everything in my camp. Um, just because that was a huge grind. And I did, I guess to an extent, to an extent I cheesed it because I did um, turn the days down so the days went by really, really fast. That way I could get the alpha bosses uh, quicker. Right. Let's cook us some burgers. Why did it not go into queue? Oh, somebody ate something, I think, right as I was... <laughs> That'll give me a 20% damage boost. The non-tens, the only reason to farm those is if you want some, in my opinion. Like, if they, if you're looking for a trait because you want to breed them or whatever, then by all means, farm the shit out of them, you know? We got homie sick. 
see which one it is. I guess we can just wake them all up. It doesn't say what his sickness is, it just says sick. It's this guy. It's the same dude. Um, that's probably not gonna get it. You need the specific. Yeah, it looks like it did get it. All right, I guess we good. All right, and we got. Our first batch. Are we going to get luck? This is going to be 40 minute ones here. Come on, RNG. Just give it to me on the first try. Don't make me breed a bunch of these damn crazy looking breezy Pegasus fluffy things. God dang it, man. <laughs> <laughs> Help has arrived. Runner Ferocious Divine Dragon. Oof. Divine Dragon. I mean, you could go with a Dragon Pen King and throw a bunch of Dragon abilities on him. Yeah, I'll get him here in a minute. If he ain't dying, he gonna have to wait. <laughs> Yeah, those are 40 minute ones. Fire dude in the wall. He getting hungry. Yep. Yep. Come on now. You got to keep these guys busy too. I found that if you just keep constantly keep them busy. Hmm. Got to be this guy, right? Yep, looks like it was him. If you keep them busy, they're l less likely to, like, fly around outside, like, dude. And now, you know, he came back in, but you gotta keep them, keep them occupied, you know? So, I mean, let's go some more refined ingots here. Um... I'm gonna need a bunch, if I get the schematic i'm gonna need a bunch of uh oh shit i should have picked up ore i'm out of ore dang it i was just there Should be a lot of ore here because I haven't checked it in a while. Holy shit, 1200 coal. Looks like the coal issue is uh, <laughs> a non issue. Something didn't get the ore. 
throw that rest of that meat in the fridge. Where'd it go? Oh, there it is. That was that junker schematic. I need to sell some of those. Why well, I don't need the money is the thing. I'm gonna trash that because I don't feel like dealing with it right now. So, do we want to go for it? What time do we got? Hmm. I'm running out of excuses. <laughs> I'm running out of excuses. I really wanted to get that. I mean, I'm not going to get it if I don't go get it. But I really want to get that meteor... the dragon meteor thing. All right. Let me swap armor back. Let me just do one quick lap on the skill trees. When I just hit these two, I just hit the ones up north too. That way. Kind of that way. Oh, it is the official clown bus, there is no doubt. Oh, this is the one that's down there, yeah. Looks like it's not respawned. Hmm, man, it's been a while, too, since I came to that one. It makes me wonder if it's like a weekly thing. We'll go up to that one and try it. I think it's RNG, isn't it? Or is it region-based? You'd think that the skill trees would give higher-leveled stuff based on... based on the area that it's in, you know? Oops. I, no, I'm going the right way. forbid you right click while you're on the clown bus it just screws your whole whole deal well yeah it's just a matter of going and doing it i mean that's like i said i kind of neglected this whole tree situation no oh, ain't no dragony shit here I wonder, too, let's try it on the next tree. I wonder if you zone out and zone back in, if the tree will reset, kind of like, kind of like the, the, um, the sanctuaries. Who is this while I'm here? Uh, I actually want another Verdash.
Get in my Pokeball. Don't want to be using the ultras on that guy. I don't care if I use a dozen of these. Default catch rate for the loss. <laughs> there we go. Oh, I still need those for XP, huh? I should wait until I have some pals in the deck that need levels. All right, where were we? We're headed towards that. What? My helium balloon ran out of helium. Uh, I'm trying to get that meteor blast skill first, uh, Uzar. Or that, that meteor or whatever. I can't remember what it's called. Ignis blast. Why is it always Ignis blast? All right, so we got Ignis blast... Icicle Cutter and Spark Blast. Let's go zone and then come back and see if it's the same. Like, if you just do that on even just that far away, I guess we'll go a little further. Um, in the sanctuaries, they're completely reset. Let's see. Ignis Blast. Icicle Cutter. Spark Blast. It's the same stuff, huh? Go ahead and blow your ass up, B Guard. So it didn't reset, huh? There's another one. It does big damage. It's actually the hardest hitting uh, pal ability in the game. Uh, but then your dude has exploded and you gotta wait 10 minutes in the pal box for it to come back. Another, uh, another effigy, too. Uh, the meteor is the same, but it's the damage type. I, I want the dragon one, the dragon meteor one for that fight. I guess if you go in with a bunch of dark damage, um... The dark damage gives a uh, um, a buff to one of them, and if you hit it with if it's too much dark damage, you'll have uh, you'll have issues with the one guy hitting too hard. All this shit waiting for these stupid cooldowns when I could just shotgun them. <laughs> I'm not sure. That's what we're trying to figure out. It seems like, like the wiki said it was every day, and it's not. And I thought maybe it was every three days, like the alpha bosses, but it's not. So I'm wondering if it's every week, or if there's a chance of it being reset every day. I have no real idea. And the information on the internet is all wrong. Imagine that, the internet being wrong. How odd.
Let's see. Let's go up and uh, check a couple of those desert trees. Did I, I just checked the desert trees there, didn't I? I'm pretty sure I just checked those. Let's see. I'll go to this one, though, and see. I think it's 150 as well. It's either 150 or 160. Uh, though. No, not reset yet. It's been, I think I just checked that one though. There's uh, where the bosses spawn. I left that marker there on the ground. That way I don't have to keep looking around for them. <laughs> I don't need them anymore though. This. Suzaku. Let me check these merchants, too, and see. I mean, it would be super cool if somebody, if there was a way to buy the PAL fluid. That would be incredible. There's supposed to be two merchants in here. I think I've only ever talked to one of them, though. Oh, there's actually... A whole shitload of them. Huh. That's a pal one. Nobody I'm interested in. That's tier, the tier one stuff. Which I've already got. I don't think it's you can. I don't think there's one anywhere. Ooh, that is kind of a score, though. Not having to farm that is good stuff. Nothing else i really interested in. Is there any other traders here, or is that it? I'm pretty sure that's it. Looks like I never yoinked this, either. There's a black market guy out back. Like, out back, out back? There's one up top. Hmm. I'm not seeing him. The one up top. One, two, three. Actually, there's four here. Or no, that's uh, just a, a dude. What up, dude? Eat shit. So he's right outside the wall. Larry Bay. Let me mark him too, just so I don't constantly forget whenever I'm over here. 
And I've been given the black market dealer that. I don't know why. That's just the one I chose. <laughs> What's he got? Nothing I want. <sighs> All right, we'll get a fresh day. And then I'll put my big boy pants on. I hear a shiny. There's been shiny spawning underneath me somewhere, too. It's going to be a stupid chicken. All right, burger time. Someone turned it into an F-16 in a mod. That is funny. All right. My breeding has come to a halt. Yeah. We're only halfway on the eggs. Don't you be eating no jam-filled buns. You come eat these jam-filled buns over here, mister. <laughs> there we go. Oh, maybe that's what it is. It's the fridge? I think it's a shiny. All right, I guess we'll try it without getting having that good ability. Somebody's stuck in the wall there. I mean, I guess I can go look. I know it's a chicken. It's always a chicken. We got two guys stuck outside. Oh, no, it's a sheep. Your noise is irritating, sheep. Eat that. All right. Man, I haven't even gotten there yet. My, my butt's puckering already. What? Over this way? All right, now the deal with this guy is there's something to do with dark damage. Like, you want dragon damage. That's why I wanted that dragon meteor. Oh, this is my true first attempt, wide eye now, so. Don't don't get too far ahead of, ahead of things. <laughs> Where the hell's he at? Should be right around here, huh? Man, there's a lot of locals around here. There they are. So you're supposed to kill Necromus first, which I'm assuming is the darker one. Yeah, I'm tempted to clear out some of those locals because I don't know. There's the thing, too, with this is there's no pillars like the tower bosses. You got all those pillars everywhere to line of sight stuff. 
But yeah, supposed to kill, um... Supposed to kill Necromus first. Alright. Let me eat my burger. Where it at? And I am going to give one to you, too, there, Mr. Jet Dragon. Let's get them all full up. Oh, he full off of that. All right, here we go. Where'd they go? Ooh, Necromus is right in the rear now. Wrong ability. I gotta wait for the cooldown to come up. Oh, that did nothing to him. Oh my goodness. Get legendaries going. Oh, god dang it. I wasted a legendary. Come on, reload, you god dang rocket launcher. Jet Ragon getting beat down here. Shit, I missed. Whoa! Holy crap, that was some serious damage. Alright, Jet Ragon's gotta go in. How do I have that turtle in my deck? Oh, hello. God, that was a big hit. Oh, Jet Dragon died from the dots. Wow, that was a beat down. Oh, that will one tap any wall in the game, like on near instantly. I got to get more survivability, I think. That was a hard ass beating right there. There's a reason why you're supposed to do that boss last. Like, people are saying you do that boss after you do all the towers. I had the element bonus. Um, and I've got usable perks. Yeah. Oof. Uh, well, I mean, I've been playing the game 18 hours a day for a week, Splendendo. <laughs> but no, I am not min-maxed in the game. But I've got a lot, a lot of time into it already. Shit, man, I'm gonna die again from the heat.
Yeah, on the plus side, I got a marker. <laughs> that was some big time damage right there, man. You see their health, you're like 9,000 health. That's nothing. Piece of cake. But oh my god, those guys are brutal. Mm. Well, Jet Dragon is dead now, so there's no there's no attempt to. Oh shit, I aggroed up by accident. Run away! Ah. Oh my god, I did die to the dot. Or it was dead to the heat. It's alright. I mean, I knew that that was going to be a chore, you know? <gasps> I mean, this boss, if you look at all the information, um, like the wikis and everything else, this boss is supposed to be done after the last tower. Plus, I don't have the right traits to do the big damage. I mean, I've got um, complementing elements. They're just not the right ones, you know? Shit, am I going to just die again? Do I need to go back and heal all the way up first? I kind of feel like I do. I mean, I'm instantly putting the heat resist stuff on. I mean, that auto-equipped it. I shouldn't be taking... Yeah, it's going back up. That was not the heat. That was the dot from the boss. As soon as my heat resist armor goes back on, I'm good. As far as the heat goes. Such a beast, though. Such an absolute beast. Well, the boss puts a dot on you is the thing, and he did attack me. I, I need that. You got to have that dragon meteor, man, for the big bomb. Or maybe the thing is, instead of trying to go into it with uh, that damage boost, go into it with survivability instead. Because there is survivability food as well. There's all kinds of buff food, you know. Let me see what it, what all there is. Let's see. Stay full. Defense by ten percent. Doesn't seem that great. Where's the this one? Yeah, that's the steak. That one's 20% defense. Your sheep will get one tapped out there. One dragon meteor is not going to be enough to do it, and your sheep will be instantly dead. I thought there was something with the Mamoras meat you could do, but I guess that's the one. 20% defenses. But yeah, clearly I'm not quite there yet. Not quite ready. Oh my god, did dude leave again? This guy doesn't want no 
No ladies? I mean, that's fine if that's your thing, dude, but you gotta at least do your part and breed it up. You gotta do your part, man. Give me the eggs. Yeah, I was losing from the heat, and then the boss hit me, and I was losing from the dot. It's no big mystery. I mean, it was pretty obvious what happened. In my opinion, anyway. Here's the dude. I mean, I saw the glow from the boss, right? I wonder why those two... I mean, they're really close to completing an egg. That's the thing, is what I'm saying. It wasn't heat damage. It was dot damage. Making your third base. I ended up making my main base the breeding base. Of course, I could add in another... Um, another uh, little uh, love shack. We got four minutes before the moment of truth. That would be so awesome. If I get uh, old Frosty Pants on the first try, that would be so crazy good. I mean, it's back to the drawing board. I just don't have any of the good dragon... Uh, dragon meteor stuff. What is the dragon? These are the dragon ones. Need to really grind these stupid fruit trees, man. And that's the worst. What stuff got equipped all weird? At least I didn't waste a bunch of rockets, you know? Wasting a bunch of rockets would have been bad. I need fireballs. I need meteors. Dragon meteors. The dark meteors are good, too. All of the meteors are good. But I still need... Um, I need two more here. I'm not sure what to put with Rag Ragnarok here. Uh, fireball. Probably is there a fire meteor too? I'm assuming there is. I gotta try it again. Did I get the one to halfway? I gotta try it again, but I gotta let uh, I gotta let homie recoup. Yeah, see, I need to get rid of that draconic breath and take the the dragon meteor, like sixty percent. Part of that, I think, was panic. I'm not used to having anything not to hide behind. Like the tower bosses are all so cheesable. They should take all of those pillars out of all the tower bosses, in my opinion. Now, I haven't done the last one yet, granted. But I feel like they should take all those uh, all those out. Dang it, man. Fireball and the ground burst thing. Some of the stuff I feel like is a little misleading, too. Like, this flare storm actually does really good. And I'm not sure, like, what does this power actually indicate? Like, that Flare Storm, there's two of them, and it hits multiple times, and it does big damage. It's damage in a single hit, so, I mean, what does CT mean? Cooldown timer? No, it can't be 18 seconds. Or is that cooldown time?
You wouldn't think it would be 18 seconds, but maybe it is. I mean, we can... We can try that out real quick. Let's see. Let's see. Yeah, I guess that's probably right, huh? It is quite the cooldown on it. God, so, so sad. I, I didn't have any real delusions of grandeur that I was going to beat that on the first try. But it would have been nice to do a little bit better than that. Just a little. All right, come on now. Give you some RNG. That's not it. That's not it. That's not it. <laughs> nope. And a nope. We got five nopes. Back to grinding trees. Yeah, well, they definitely have massive damage reduction. The, 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 part, the hard part is the two of them. Like, it's pretty easy to dodge one of them's attacks. But to dodge both of them's attacks, particularly when you've got a lot of spectators, you got to be careful as to where you're running off to, you know? So, like, I was worried about all the... about getting ads and... Palladius is actually the one that owned me, I think. What time are we at? Close. Is it too early? No. Nope. It's good. Well, I mean, that was my first try. If I beat it on my first try, then the game would be too easy. And I would be done. You know, that's the hardest fight in the game, and I didn't beat it on my first try. I mean, I consider that normal. You know. If you beat it your first try, then I'm done with the game. Go play something else. Wait for an update. So I'm glad I didn't beat it on the first try. I mean, I just got to get good, right? Practice uh, practice is the route to getting good. <laughs> and I need a little good uh, need a little get good in my in my life. We got two homies outside again. It's because I'm not keeping them busy. I'm not sure who that was. Watching videos of people beating it, they make it look so easy. We got two penguins, and what is that? We got two penguins that are going to get hungry. That is just somebody in the terrain right there. I'm probably going to end up having to pull everybody out. They don't have a hammer on their icon, reset them. That's probably a good idea, huh? Well, these guys have nothing to do. He's going to get stuck back behind there. And here I was crafting Pat the pal metal in advance because I was going to need it for my new armor schematics that are a rare chance to drop as it is. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, there's hundreds of videos of people beating it on YouTube. But no, nah, nobody shows their world settings. Of course not. The one, I'm assuming, damage was turned up because his rocket launcher did a whole hell of a lot more damage than my rocket launcher did. Like the video I watched last night, dude's rocket launcher was just chonking on it. All right. Let's see. Could be this one. They just don't have anything to do, I think. These penguins. Should be it. Now there's still somebody hungry in there. He wasn't mounted, though, is the thing. The video I watched, he popped his... He did exactly that, except he had the meteor. He, he dropped the meteor, then hopped off his jet rag and started rocket launching it. And it was super quick. Yeah, I mean, it could have been a full... Actually, no, it wasn't, because I looked at his... He did show his rolls... Oh, shit. I did not mean to right-click that guy. God damn it. And why is Grizz sleeping in the middle of the day? This Anubis looks hungry. I bet it was bushy. Yeah, it was one of those. It's gone now. It's gonna take some work. I still feel like the hamburger's probably the right way. I'm out of cows now, though. Gonna run fresh out of cows. So rough. All right, so we're two next. I'm not ready to go back out and try that again. I've got a legendary rocket launcher. <clears throat> now, which one was my one? That one was a legend. I mean, I got legend divine dragon and ferocious on it i mean i've got one role that's not a dps role aramir which your kappas <laughs> this is pretty much a dps dragon right i mean plus attack plus dragon damage plus attack that, that's the only thing i have that's not Oh, you meant it's player stats. Welcome back, homie. I mean, I didn't go into... Well, I mean, how do you change your player stats? In the settings menu, where you crank up...
Well, the problem, Jet, the Jets stayed alive for plenty of time. Most people are beating it that quick. I'm going with the, I'm using the exact same setup they're all using. The only difference is I don't have the Dragon Meteor. It's literally the only difference. That, and he's not dark, he's a dragon. So, the deal is, he's got dark abilities and dragon abilities. Dragon laser hits really, really hard. Uh, but, dragon, or the dark ability will also, like, stack up some kind of debuff or whatever against Necromus. Some, there's some kind of interaction with Necromus collecting dark stacks. I don't know. I want to try it again, though. I need to get that stupid bomb. I mean, you get no... Yeah, I mean, he used his missile launcher. Oh, yeah. I'm not going to do character reset. I probably never will. I don't have any reason to reset him, you know? Or where do you do that? You do that in your technology? I mean, I don't have... Uh, my drag... I got most of my stuff dumped into this, so... This is damage that I'm missing out on, right? And max health. I need to go collect the baby, the small souls. I keep eating them all up. Need four more to take it up again. I mean, I could max out max health and attack here. That's probably just the way. I mean, literally three... I got three passives, awesome passives, you know? I wish there was a way to buy the, the small ones, the small souls. You can't buy those anywhere, can you? Because they're just, it's so irritating. I click on every damn chest I see. All right. Let's see if uh, I can get a little bit of uh, stable RNG here and at least check the check the island. Yeah. Shit, I should have rested up first, huh? Don't want to be resting up in there. Come on, be there, big uh, Grizz. What's his name? Grizzvolt? Grizzbolt? No, doesn't look like going to be here this time. God dang it. Uh, I right clicked by accident. Son of a bitch. So irritating. There's no criminal activity going on here. All right. Let's go back up. Uh...
Where's the best cow farm? It was the brown cherry boss, right? And it's not this one. It's the regular brown cherry. Now I don't know where the hell he is. Yeah, it just sucks. It's such a grind, you know, to get the the low level shit. Let me just take a let me take a look up in this area here and see if we got any cows. Bottom left item island. Any mooing going on anywhere? Sheep. I'm not seeing any mooing. God damn it, and I right clicked again. This mount has got so many negatives with it and only one positive. It's so ridiculously fast, you know? Everything else about that mount sucks. I'm just looking for more, uh, more hamburger. And I know that there was hamburger around there. Where's the beef? <laughs> what was that, 1980s uh, Wendy's commercial? It's nowhere near as fast. Having a 100% perfect of the second fastest mount is half the speed of this one. L like, literally. The second fastest mount is that freezy one. The Frost Allion. I'm pretty sure. I ain't seeing new moon going on here either. Dire house. You just can't right click. And the problem is, is I play so many games where you're spamming right click, my finger just kind of naturally hits the right click all the time. I wonder if weapon swapping would change it. Let me see. Oh, you can hit another ability and get out of it, it looks like. Or no, it puts you right back in it. No way to we weapon swap. The only way to get out of it is to dismount and remount. Come on, you stupid dragon. That, and it looks like you're riding a blow-up doll. Like, a literal blow-up sex doll. It's just, this is the worst mount. Why did I even bother? But, I mean, good lord, look at the zoom value. <laughs> That's why I bothered. Because it's so fast. These guys have some good meat for something, too, I thought. Shit, man, I ain't seen a damn cow anywhere, and I right-clicked again. God damn it. I know there's an area with a shitload of cows, right? Let me check this. Oh, over there. Well, I went there and farmed cows before. I just went the wrong way. Oh, 
uh, the the boss uh, stuff, the Palladius. I mean, I don't think you can quite call it struggling yet. You could say made first attempt and failed, but there's not been a repeated attempt yet. Fight him at night, and one will sleep. Huh. Have you, you haven't killed that already, have you? Or did you read that somewhere? You have killed it? You've kill, killed Palladius? Really? Well, I mean, that's definitely... That's pretty huge. You know, if you can, if one of them is snoozing, that's kind of a big deal. Oh, well, that's kind of convenient considering you're supposed to kill Necromus first anyway. All right, don't right click. Whatever you do, get off and use your shotgun or crossbow. No, oh, crossbow weak. Use shoddy to the face. Works like a tramp. I guess I could use the dragon's other abilities and then not have to dismount. <laughs> he just died before the projectile got to him. That's so funny. There's only the one, right? The one healer? I can't remember who it is. Oh, can I pull that off the right click? No, that's the rocket launcher is the thing. I don't think I can swap that one. Or can you? Give me my stakes. Hey, I ain't doing all that. I don't need that many. I just needed a few stakes to give me some fake courage before I go try again. It's like having a beer before you go ask out some guy or girl that you're attracted to. It gives you a false sense of security. <laughs> that's what the that's what the hamburger does for me. Gives me that false sense of security. Beaming him. Oh, it's so fast, but it's just the worst looking pet in the game, and it's so janky um, getting stuck on stuff and everything else. It's a slap in the face, this is. This being the best or the fastest mount in the game is a straight up slap in the face. It's the developer saying, ha ha, Pokemon sucks. Fuck you guys. Give us your money. That's what this mount is. It's that bad. hate that fucking thing but once again just like you mentioned it's so fast you know
I mean, it looks stupid. You can't possibly think that mount looks good. It looks like something you would buy in a porn shop in downtown Houston. <laughs> it's that bad. Plus, it's glitchy and it gets stuck on things. Just think, porn shop in downtown Houston, screw goblin. <laughs> Inflatable friend, porn shop. <laughs> I just don't get what they're thinking when you've got stuff that looks so good. I mean, you know, look at the, the Frost Aliens. I mean, that's way too my, my Little Pony for my taste. But I can at least appreciate the art direction, you know? There is no art direction on the blow-up dial. <laughs> Alright, well, they're at least putting out now. With this base, I think Suzaku looks really cool. Um, but with my base design, it wouldn't work. Like the Ragnarok will get to the things and ignite the furnaces and stuff where the Suzaku was just too big. Shadowbeak looks awesome. It's got some big old bombs too, huh? All right, we're fresh day, right? Yeah, so we gotta wait till night to go back up there. Wixen, I wish that there was more small ones. <laughs> Just chilling. <laughs> I wish there was more real sm smaller models. So it's not so in your face all the time. You know? Like, I wish Anubis was the biggest guy I had running around the base. As far as the base goes. Now, when I'm out in the world, give me a, you know, give me a freight train to, to uh, cruise around in. So, yeah, I definitely appreciate uh, that aspect with uh, Wixen. Who is the, who's the pal that heals? I may not even have that one yet. There's only one. I can't remember who it is, though. Lileen. What element is she? Oh, there's two? Who's the other one? Or is it just a variant of Lileen? Lifelink. Oh, that seems pretty decent. Oh, there's a bunch of stuff that heals then. Teapot heals? Man, they need to update this wiki. Get with it, y'all. Get the wiki updated. <laughs> the wiki says there's only one uh, pal that heals. Yeah, Felbat and Lavander have the lifelink. That seems pretty powerful right there. Especially if it's a percentage of your damage output and you're spraying at them with a rocket launcher. But then you got blow up dial number two and she's in your party. So there's just some wrongness with that.
I don't remember what Lilene looks like. No. Well, yeah, it's going to be a copy paste, I'm sure. She's the flower girl. Yeah, I remember what the model looks like, but I don't remember what the icon looks like. It's not fire. The grass one isn't a field boss, so less likely. No clue. There's the fell bat. That's got that life steal as well. That one looks kind of interesting. This is what I want, man. I want stuff this big running around. Oh, that was it. I killed her. I didn't capture her. That's right. Because I had too much overkill. It's all right. We're about halfway through the day. How long these burgers last? They last a while. 20 minutes. That's not too bad. Wraith is tied with Quivering for your favorite pal. I don't really think I have a favorite, I guess. I like Rag, uh, Ragnarok just because of the name and the play off of uh, Ragnarok, but... Get out of the way, dude. All right. Well, we will try it again here as soon as it gets dark. I'm going to go without the heals just because I don't think I have that healer here. I guess we can see. It's a regular mob and a boss, right? I just want to see if I've ever looted them. The top right island, the the sanctuary island. Oh, Lilene's on sanctuary. I gotcha. Yeah, it looks like... Oh, no, no data. I guess I've never uh, captured it. Well, let's run up there real quick and see if there's one there. <gasps> yep. I don't want you. You're slow. I want my blow-up dial, my blow-up clown bus. Oh, you know, the problem is I can't right-click on this guy. Let me uh, not use legendary spears on this, too. Oh, see, I right-clicked. Yeah, 
in your experience she's rare i've seen her up here before let me switch mounts sorry flamey bird i didn't mean to talk trash Get rid of the criminal activity thing. What up, dude? I'm just here to steal y'all animals. Ooh, that one's rare, isn't it? I've already got a bunch of those, though. Bunch of bushies. Get the stamina back here real quick. So what's the deal with the island? Like, I've been staying mounted the whole time to capture stuff on the islands. But I guess if you kill all of the witnesses... You're good, too? Yeah, that's what I've done, too. Just fly around. Stay mounted, no problems. The cops spawning, once they aggro to you and start spawning, you have to get out of the aggro area. I had them bugged uh, last night. I couldn't, uh, couldn't get them. And, um, I went way, way far out into the sea and then logged out and logged back in and they were gone. Oh, if you log out anywhere, they'll reset. Oh, okay. The hell is the damn waypoint at? Or I guess it doesn't matter. We're uh we're here anyway. It's getting dark. Let's see if they sleeping. This guy is a zoomer. That is for sure. God damn it. And of course I right clicked. Don't make me kill you, dude. Let me resets over here, huh? Oh, ho, ho, homie got a rocket launcher.
Where the hell are they at? Oop, there they are. Not dark enough yet. So what's the deal? Uh, Necro is dark and Palladius, or Palladius is neutral. Necro, Necromus is dark, Palladius is neutral. And what were those again? Dark is neutral. So dragon and dark. Yeah, okay. So, I, you know, I've got the right setup. I just need to get good. Oh, just go to sleep already. First, Astagon's a pacifist. Oof. <laughs> what time is it? Oh, it's still a long way until it gets dark. I thought we were closer to the dark. This needs it to get dark. Ooh. That guy right there is so cool, man. they go they turn around well i mean yeah they're not meant to be tamed you know i get that you know Just go to bed already. And kill these guys off too. Or they'll be sleeping anyway. It doesn't matter. I just think it would be cool as hell dropping that dude and having him bust out that minigun. That would be some crazy shit right there. Getting closer.
Oh, shit. Point zero eight percent shitty sphere. to shoot him too much more. Got a rare diggy boy. I would love to set up a DPS uh, version of that that guy. That would just be beyond cool. I'll wait until it's officially dark. You want? I'm just gonna chill right here for a moment. Give me just one moment, y'all. I'm gonna go uh, grab a drink of water while we're waiting for nighttime to happen here. I'm just gonna chill right there. I'll be right back in just a second here.
they saw in logs. Let's see. Now watch, I won't be able to find them until the sun comes up. Hmm. Oh, they ain't sleeping. Or are they? Oh, I see. One is sleeping. One is not. Yep. Got to be careful with what you use, huh? Oh, no. It tracked over. That's not doing any damage anyway. I'm resetting them. Hmm. Or maybe I'm not. Maybe I'm gonna f die instead. Oof. You got to come prepared for cold weather at night. <laughs> well, I am like completely unprepared. God damn it. I am never going to kill that fucking thing, am I? And I got shitty, my cold armor sucks, is the problem. Oh. Hmm. Just the cold shirts you think will do it? I only got one. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Well, I can't use that ability. I just got to set this dragon up. I'm going to quit fucking with it. I feel like I'm just wasting my time now. Um, Because the dragon is... I just don't have the right abilities. I don't know how you did it so easy, Soph. Because it seemed like just not too long ago, I was way geared out compared to you. And I haven't stopped playing. <laughs> you must have some, uh, some secrets. You started the same day I did. But have you slept? <laughs> Oh, during the week at the hospital, you grinded. That's fair. That's fair. Let's see. So, I can buy another shirt. Where is that desert shop? I never remember. I just put a waypoint there, too. Oh, there it is. Derp. The one with the waypoint on it. Now it says I'm hot. Is my armor busted or something? Oh, I did have cold weather stuff on. Or no, it auto-equipped that. When I looted my death bag. 
All right, that's the Pal Merchant. We'll buy another shirt. Nothing. Yeah. Check the black market guy, I guess. Looks like he got thicker. Right now. Same old same old guy. What's he got? Nothing. He's got that again. Bell bats already. I've already got everything else. Yeah. All right. So now we wait for another night to come. What am I going to do in the meantime? Let me check that island again real quick. Yeah, I took off the heat armor as in death. <laughs> Death removed my heat armor. I got a bazillion Astagons already. This one it seems like it's either what is it smaller or there's never as many animals here at this one it seems like compared to the other two there's a shadow beak god damn it I done killed the shadow beak. Yeah. No kill, quite like overkill. Yeah, right, and then I've got another shirt here somewhere. I'm gonna get rid of some of this junk. I'm not gonna bother selling it at the vendor. There needs to be a box saying, uh... Do not ask next time or something. You can kite the Necro a little bit away. I'm going to need the shirts. Oh, 
All right. Uh, to pull it away a little bit. I got my burgers. Just need to need to wait it out to the next day. See if we got any. All right, they're putting out. They're putting out. Right, come on, be there. Ferocious legend, Ice Emperor, burly body, ba boom. Do I even hatch these? Way to go, y'all done bread a winner. That is so nice. That's what I was going for. So we got three damaging um, things and two defensive. It should be a scrapper, right? Let's uh let's level that bad boy up. Should be a scrapper. Why is he sick? Come on, dude. Don't start. Don't start. Don't start. Oh, good lord. You go, homie. Oof. Bad grapple. Still pretty solid on the ore. Out of these guys. Oh, I got 200 of them sitting. Perfect. Well, I can get those out of there now. So I've got a uh, ice pet uh, covered. I don't need to keep using up the cake. What do I want to breed next? I need to get, um, actually, I don't have any good ones, though, with any good traits. These are almost, actually, I got a mix now. Females and males. Diet lover is the only good trait so far. I'm digging that Frost Alley on, though. That is beast. How big is that, I wonder? I mean, I think that's God roll. Is it? Is that not God roll? For a combat pet? It's not as big. It's still pretty big, but it's not as big. I mean, I can't think of anything I would want um, more on that. I guess burly body. Well, yeah, 
but I mean, I've got 20% damage, uh, 20% damage, 20% damage, as long as I get rid of that and move it to ice. She only got 1,500. Well, she's only level 12. But the health is a little low, is the deal. So I wanted to get Burly on there to give her a little survivability. Dead pals do no damage. That's right. <laughs> I don't have any good Grizzbolts. So what do you do? Do you start breeding with Diet Lover in a blank? And just try to get the rolls? Because they're so rare. You know? And just go full RNG it the whole way? Well, I mean, I could get one more thing for more damage. That's literally the only thing. Everything else is best in slot. Ice Emperor, best in slot. Legend, best in slot. Ferocious, best in slot. I I just don't see why you would take another 10% or 15% damage uh, and give up the 20% damage reduction. Yeah, kind of brew them up while I'm, while I'm trying to catch more. This is true. Let's do that. We'll go Diet Lover. Help. Which one was that? That's the male. Yep. And then we'll go with a blank one. Here's a, fe a blank female. Get to Grizz Bolton up in there. Oh, yeah. I still should have 100 cake left still, right? 105. That'll work. Now, I, I just... I mean, do I hatch these? I guess you hatch them anyway to get them out of the inventory, huh? Better to have more eggs when it comes to omelet making time. <laughs> I'm just going to throw them in there. Alright, how we doing? We're about three quarters of the way through the day. I can go, um... Oops. I can go skill train until uh, it gets dark, because I need... I mean, you never know, maybe I'll get lucky. Where the hell are you going, dude? Where do we want to go? I feel like I haven't hit these ones in a while. We'll go try that one, that one, and then go to Volcanoes, I guess. Oof. So close. Oh my god. <laughs> it looks like that one didn't have anything on it. Uh, everybody pulls their pets when big attacks are coming. I just wanted to kind of get a feel for the fight there. That's not anything. I mean, that's like, that's 101 stuff there. Tornado. 
Man, all I'm getting is the shitty fruit. Let's see. I guess we'll go to that one. I don't think I'm going to do the clown mount, uh, Aramir. I can't stand it. I mean, I complained about the mount uh, to begin with, just looking at it. Now that I've got one, I absolutely hate it. It's got one thing. It goes real fast. Everything else about it, this mount, is just awful. I mean, I wait. if my wife walks in the room, I'll dismount right away. Because I don't want her to see me riding a fucking blow-up doll. It's ridiculous. Yeah. All right, I'm sure we can make it over to that one, right? Jesus, man, if my son tunes into the stream, he is going to give me so much shit for riding around on this thing. <laughs> I mean, it's like Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade up in here. You know what I'm saying? Oh, I don't care. They're entitled to their opinion, and I'm entitled to mine, so... We don't have to agree, you know? Somebody else likes it, good for them. They can get one IRL in downtown Houston at... Nudes, nudes, nudes. I hate it, Omni. I absolutely hate it. Absolute clown mount. <laughs> the neon flashing sign. Oh, yeah, you gotta have the neon. That's all I get is these same ones over and over and over again. What's the time? Getting closer, but still not there yet. So maybe... See, here's the thing. You can't use your crossbow when you're on the clown bus. Because it, the whole deal with the mount is when you right-click, it goes to the... It goes to the rocket launcher. So, I, like, I can't shoot it and then run away. Um, well, I mean, Omni, I'm not gonna lie. I'm, I am, I am that tryhard. I hate it. <laughs> but, you know, I didn't just take it as is. I had to get it dialed in. <laughs> We got speed and damage. Love it. <laughs> All right. I guess we can head that way. How my burger's doing? Well, let me drop this crap off. Hmm, I'm gonna need another box for crap skills. The crap skills box. I'll just put them in here for now. Oh, the base Anubis was stuck? God. 
of all the ones, the smallest model on my base is the one that got stuck, huh? I don't know which one it was, but... They unstuck now. They going after the jam. Get you them jam-filled buns. Oh, there was no luck involved. That was pure grind. Uh, if I there if I knew there was a way to crank the drop rate up, I certainly would have. <laughs> it took me two days of uh, straight grinding, like two IRL days of straight grinding. Well, I've got it all now. I've got every legendary that I want. Um, not the armor, of course, because I can't seem to kill these guys yet. But as far as the weapons, I've got all of them. I've even got ones I don't want. But I targeted that. Oh, yeah. Well, the legendary helmet I actually had really early. But yeah, I got all the stuff. The only thing I don't have is the legendary bow, um, the legendary armor off these guys. I uh, I guess I cheesed it to an extent. I didn't turn the drop rate up, but I turned the day cycle down so that the day, because they only spawn every three days. So I made it so that the days were super fast. That way I'd get through the three days quicker. So I guess that's about the same thing. Uh, there's a slider for it. You can slow it up or speed it down. Most people are slowing it down. But you can slow it, speed it up or slow it down. You can also make it so that two of the... Assuming you can handle the fight, if you crank the mob spawn rate up to three, it gives you two of every alpha boss when they spawn. You can fight them two at a time, like Beacon with the the pistol that is uh super easy so you can fight two of those at a time all day um the shoddy one you can fight two at a time all right so what do i do here Palladius is sleeping right do i just dismount and not that first attack wasn't doing dick anyway Forgot about my... Gotta have you a hamburger first. Oh, too far. What? what? Yeah. Way to, way to start it off and miss. God damn it. I gotta quit missing. The reload on the rocket launcher is just terabad.
This is where that healer would come in handy, huh? You almost have to wait for the attack and then knock it down with the rocket launcher. Shit. God dang. Boom. All right, let's go get y'all homie. Yeah, man, that's game changer coming in at night. That is way different, way different experience. Now we can go full dragon on the other dude. And where the hell was he? Shit. I'm stuck. Oh my God, I'm overweight. Shit, man, they're gonna respawn, aren't they? There he is. Swing and a miss. Yeah, it did nothing, huh? It looked cool, though, Omni. It looked cool. Oof. Oof. Wow. Did you see how much damage that was? Oh, my God. Jesus Christ, I am missing every single time. Wow, he charges a long way, huh? <laughs> Shit. Somebody up on me. Me up on me from behind. Or no, I guess they're not. Oh no. Don't one tap me, brother.
Oh shit. Oh, is he resetting? Oh no, he's resetting. Oh, he's still low. Whoa! Oh no! Overkilled him. Well, you know the rule. Hide the evidence. Where's the cliff? Oh, that's not a cliff. That's alright. We've got no cliff to throw him off of. You see nothing. Nothing happened over here. Ooh, good call. No, I guess you can't slide push him. <laughs> he is now known as Sharkbait. See you, shark bait. Well, I mean, I wanted to catch him, obviously, but, you know, he had his burn dot on him, and that last uh, shot from my clown ship uh, the last shot from the clown ship um, was the dot. But. I mean, now that I know the easy peasy trick on how to do it, it's a matter of how much rocket launcher ammo do I have left. 79. I could kill him three more times. Just uh, without making uh, more ammo. But the important thing is that he's got the little check mark now. And I've still got some that don't have it. Like... Eliza B. I can remember killing, fighting Eliza B. All of these. I remember doing the sweeper. I remember doing Brown Cherry. And Nightwing. Nightwing was like. That was one of the first guys I was using forever. I was using the boss version of Nightwing. But yeah. And then I got a bunch of menastics from the sanctuary, but. I'm assuming that's in a cave, and I haven't found it yet. I guess, you know, what time is it? Let's see. Yeah. Oops. Oh, the day's just starting. Let's go try to get that one. See if I can find it. I'm sure there's a cave entrance. Oh. Let's see, so we want to go this away. Fish. Let's find the mine shaft. The orange area southwest of the icon. Ah, okay. I mean, is that it right there? Yep, there it is. I mean, I can't imagine I'm going to want to farm this one for anything, but just in case. Let's put our little star right there.
Oh, it's the Scorpion King. Gonna have to watch his health here. God damn it, I killed that one too. That breath attack has got quite a dot or whatever associated with it. This stuff just burns after that. But anyway, he did. I've got a bunch of those already from the sanctuary, so I don't. I'm gonna have to get out and capture uh, Palladius, but but that guy, I've got uh, tons of them. Check. I guess I can go loot that now because I'm not farming that boss anymore. I left the corpse on the ground. That way it would be easier to identify the boss spawn spot because I was... That was the thing I wanted more than anything. Was the shoddy. Hold on. <laughs> All ammo? That that would be a real game changer right now. I mean, it's the reason I'm not using the assault rifle at all. Damn it, man. I hate it when it does that shit. Wh which uh, shop is it, Omni? Is it the, it's not the desert shop here, is it? Fishman Island. Really? Huh. I'm surprised I never noticed that one. Because I've been... I mean, I've farmed that Ragnahawk more than anything else. Nope. Tree not up yet. Let's go over there and take a look. Dude, that's going to be huge if they sell everything. I mean, I can't imagine they'd sell everything, but maybe. You didn't know there was a village there? There's a waypoint right out in front of it. Uh, actually, it's this. Fisherman's Point. A bunch of the vendors, the de desert vendor has the oil, too. What's up, dude? What you doing? Looking all grumpy and whatnot. Wait, you ain't no stormtrooper, dude. Quit trying to pretend. Shoot him. <laughs> Holy shit. Are you kidding me? I have been grinding the sulfur thing so hard. Oh, is there a Stormtrooper mod? Oh, wrong ammo. It's cheap, too. 
Look at that, 200 rounds for 30K. Hundred and fifty K for a stack. That is nice. Wonder what the golden crown looks like. What else did he sell? Oh dude, soul vendors would be huge. That would take away too much of the grind I think though flare storm yeah you can get that oil from a few it's the pal uh, the deal that this ammo vendor really saves is that how fluid. Oh, there's somebody with buff food back here? <laughs> Flame worshipping villager. Man, you can't be worshiping the flames, lady. Which chick is it? Non traversable stairs. I don't see anybody else. This is a shanty, man. Hmm. I don't know. I must have missed him. I've talked to everybody here. Except uh, that person. <laughs> Nobody down here now. Oh, the other one. Hey, yeah, it could have been another base, huh? I haven't talked to this guy. No, he ain't got nothing. Oh, the try a guard. The other guard was over here, right? <laughs> sensitive nosed officer. He looks very sensitive. He just gave me some sulfur, just rando sulfur giver. I talked to her already. I thought, did I not? Oh, stir-fried veggies, I see. It lasts an hour for me. 
Temporarily increase. My burgers are better than that. The burgers are 20%. That's junk food. But, of course, the burgers, you got to go cow hunting. What's the best way to make legendary spears? Um, I mean, you just have to make them. There's no good or bad way to do it. You, a lot of people seem to have a problem with the cement. Um, but the bones you can buy from a vendor. So, I mean, there's no best way. You just, you just make them. Carbon fiber, cement, metal, you know, pile metal. I can what, make another 30? Another 32 of them right now? So, just a matter of keeping everybody busy and... You know, make them when you, when you get them. I need to get me uh, some breedable Orzerks, too. See how these uh, folks are doing over here. That about sums it up there, Elmer Fun. Thirty minutes on these. That's weird. All of them have been twenty or forty so far. Oh, they're supposed to be an hour, but I'm getting the, the bonus is what it is. Holy crap, man. What? Nine minutes, we're good. Oh, bird in the way. Get out of here, bird. But yeah, that sulfur grind I was bitching about. Uh, well, I mean, that really, really is a non issue now. Because, I mean, I haven't been using this specifically because I didn't want to make so much ammo and burn through it. Let's see how that looks. Oh, geez, the pews. How much does it hit for? I mean, that's against the lobby. Wow, it actually hits these lobbies really hard. might be um well i mean the rocket launcher is the rocket launcher only shoots one shot every 17 years but holy shit do they feel it <laughs> i've got every weapon now except the bow i guess i need to go get the bow huh see what this does against uh alpha pick a he's a good mid-tier alpha actually i haven't killed anubis in a while let's go see how fast it mows down anubis hmm. 
See, look at that, the little baby pews versus boom. <laughs> There's a big damn difference in damage done. Oops. Oh, your PC would be fine. The problem is, is you gotta constantly stop too, Omni. There is good and bad about going that fast. Like you have to stop and let the mobs uh, catch up. I was like, what? There's another Anubis. Why? I keep hitting the wrong button is why. Hmm. No, nope, can't use those. Yeah. Man, he wants, yeah. he wants ultras, huh? Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. Mixed feelings, mixed emotions on the uh, assault rifle. 30 round clip. Yeah. I mean, it just destroys lobies. I mean, it seems pretty decent. Yeah. I I still have qu question whether or not it's comparable to the rocket launcher. You know, the rocket launcher just it it wallops, man. It just wallops. But I'll give you guys an idea of how many. Uh, how many kills that took? To get these things. Oh, fail. Good luck trying to pick shit up. Who was that? Eh, it's too low level. I was gonna go try that alpha, but the it's just gonna melt. Did we get leveled up yet? 
43. But let's get on back and let's see. So Frostallion only 20 kills, and I've got the legendary drop. Uh, Jet Ragon. It took me a minute to get the rocket launcher, but still, 36. 36 kills to a rocket launcher. Um, 40 kills for the shotgun. I guess it's not that bad. It felt like it was way more than that. Uh, is it Astagon? No, it's not Astagon. It's Blazamut. 22 kills on Blazamut to get the assault rifle. You're at 83 on Suzaku. Well, your RNG sucks, off. I mean, it literally took me two days, 14 hours a day of real lifetime to get them all. At that many kills. Well, I mean, I don't need it now. I've got, uh, literally, the only thing I'm missing is the bow, and the bow's no use. If they had, well, in the armor, I, you know, obviously I gotta farm uh, Palladius tonight. It's not three times. The alpha bosses, it doubles. If you set it to three times, it actually doubles them. But the biggest thing is, is they only, um, they only spawn every three days. So if you shorten the day cycle. Uh-oh. We got a raid. I haven't had a, seen a raid in ages. Everybody's sleeping. Yeah. Way to use the machine gun there, Anubis. Thanks, homie. Those machine guns are janky as hell, man. Holy shit. Did everything... Oh my god! Nobody even bothered getting out of bed. Anubis is like, Oh, y'all are mine. That was like next to nothing. Uh, in damage. That was crazy. Yep. Anubis did that slam move and the entire pack died. That is absolutely absurd. Everybody's still like snoring away over here. Like, homie, you got a big fat bed over here not being used. What are you doing on this little bed? All right, y'all. It is uh, about that time uh, for me, though. Yeah, but I mean, I haven't repaired anything yet once. Like, I've never repaired anything. I mean, that didn't take damage. None of this took damage. This is the only stuff of any consequence here, and that one took 17 points of damage. That one took 16 points. That one took no damage. Crazy, crazy, crazy. And that's with a bad Anubis, too. My Anubis is not dialed in in any way. I mean, he's actually got nothing I want on him. 
Diet Lover is just a nice quality of life to always have. But, anyway, y'all, that is going to get it for me for today. Um, appreciate y'all hanging out. Let's see if I got any uh, eggs ready to pop. Nah, still a ways off on those. So, uh, can't do those before, uh, before the end, but I am going to go get me some yummies as, uh, the dinner bell has rung. Ah. So anyway, thanks a ton for hanging out. Uh, hopefully y'all are all having a wonderful start to your week and I will see you guys tomorrow. Take it easy, y'all.